We are back. Oh, we're doing another ah, one. Ah, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. No one told me we were doing another one. Well, it's been told and it's been done, and here we are again. It's been done. It hasn't been told. Hey, look, another chest with a thing that looks like a huge tit in it. Hey, it fittings, considering it's a chest. <laughs> yes. Yes. Keep wishing, and all your dreams will come true. So Even the scary if... ones? <laughs> yes. Especially the scary ones. Uh, I love Flapjack. No homo, right? All of the homo! Alright, this part is really, and I mean, holy crap, really annoying. I'm gonna just stand here. I'm gonna take my time here and wait for this book to not cockbug, because I know the moment I move, this book is gonna come back and it's gonna be like, dude. Yeah, don't be afraid to take your time in a second. I'm talking to the audience, not you, everyone. Dude, look at the wind outside. What? I said, look at the wind outside. Ah. What about it? Well, you weren't looking a few seconds. Ah. A few seconds ago, it was like monstrously windy. Do you really have to get up? I love how the books bounce off of you if you're in that little cutscene of getting back up. Yeah, they can only hit you by the shirt. They can't. They bounce off of your house. Dude, coat. how the hell did that work? I was behind it and right here. He, like, zoomed to the front of that. And not to mention, he climbed down the ladder and went through the floor. Isn't this game so wonderfully glitchy? It's beautiful. I should actually go to the library. You can't actually go to the library during the daytime, but it... Why not? Because then there won't be prefects there. And I think I might do that because there's a bunch of doorways you can open with spells. And we're going to get that splooge spell when we get through here. Wait, what? It's a green, like... It's, it looks like the cum of the Incredible Hulk, basically. Like those, oh, you mean it can open those chests that have the, uh... Sludge. And there's also yeah. a couple doorways that can be opened with it, too. <laughs> what the fuck was that? So, if you stand still long enough, that's his idle animation, almost falling to a horrible and grisly death. Well, would you be scared? Who the hell can even get to these books? Dumbledore. <laughs> They, everyone has to ask Dumbledore to get a book. Well, nobody goes in the restricted section now that I think about it. This is probably Dumbledore. Ow, my face. This is probably Dumbledore. What the fuck? Area. Basically, every book, from what I understand, from the, um... Dude. Dude, fucking stop. Dude. <laughs> the power of knowledge. I'm trying to back up. I'm trying here. Okay. Now let's wait for the book to leave this time. What the fuck? That that hurt. Dude! <laughs> I'm not going to lie, this is hilarious. <laughs> okay, go, go, go. Holy crap. Now, like I was saying, the books that are in the forbidden, the restricted section are all basically dark magic and, like, books, biographies about people and Hogwarts that aren't supposed to be told through anybody. So is this the Chamber of Secrets? Oh, we'll see the Chamber of Secrets, honey. Uh, but now I'm all wrapped in suspense. Do you, do you know where the cham Do you know what this Chamber of Secrets is? I've never seen the movie. Oh well, you'll figure it out from watching this game. So wait, was Voldemort? Is this the first movie Voldemort was in? Was he in the first one? Yes, he was in the first one on the back of some guy's head. What? If you watch Sorcerer's Stone, you would understand. There was this but guy who had a turban over his head, and in the back of it was 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 Voldemort's face in the back of his head. So basically, Voldemort didn't even have a physical being at the time. He doesn't have a physical being until, like, the fourth movie. Oh, and then he gets that he... weird no-nose face? Yeah. No. And he holds this wand like that. He's beautiful. He's L. <laughs> yeah, he's L in disguise with less with less, less cool hair. And not Dude, ah. Hey, you only got half your health left. I know, I'm getting my ass kicked by knowledge. <laughs> Well, hey, sounds like a regular day at school for you. <laughs> You're funny. This part's pretty cruel, too. You do have these last two books about the cock block you hear. a hot girl and a very, and a very mild looking girl just walked by the window. Dude, why you gotta troll me, man, right when I'm trying to time well, this out? I wasn't trolling you, I was staring. They caught me staring. Oh, they caught me killing. Oh. Be aggressive. That's from. That's another baby cake song. B E aggressive. S of B aggressive. Please stop. Oh oh. Well, hey, you're not. You're not as dead now. Yep. 
And here's another chest. I think they stock you up on health here because you're going to get your ass kicked by knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> because Harry's such a moron because he never made it past elementary when it comes... Why does it look like there's a diploma up there? It's Dumbledore's. <laughs> no one wants to know where the diploma is. This part is actually kind of creepy. Why? Because there's a bunch of ghosts. Well, I mean, not in this part, but in the next area. And there's Books! a bunch of... <laughs> See, the knowledge kicks, you, kicks your ass in the school. That's why no one learns regular things in the school. Because they're afraid of the, how <laughs> thick the geometry books will be. <laughs> even the even in one of the, the third movie, there's a monster book that, like, attacks you. Hedwig! Hedwig! <laughs> that is an owl. His head looks weirdly shaped. Well, maybe he's wearing a wig. Why is it that it seemed like later movies forget about like characters like Hedwig and like I don't think Hedwig's really that much of a character. See look at the wind. Look outside real quick. Isn't it beautiful? And I don't think Hedwig's really all that important, is he? He's just an owl. I mean it's not like the owls in Lord of the Rings, which you haven't seen. I yeah, I should see that, shouldn't I? Yeah. Tell you what, you watch Lord of the Rings, I'll watch the Harry Potter movies. Well, I'll try to find them then. Now, can I kill these books, please, before they kill me? With their flapping mouths? Hey, look what I found! A dead rat! Yes! Seriously? That is actually a dead rat. Oh, an owl tree. <laughs> uh, so what, you have to pay Hedwig to get a book for you? You have to pay Hedwig to knock down the thing to get your own book, because that it's right up there. You almost get, I'm getting that my ass the, kicked here. That is the youngest collection of white trash I've ever seen. Holy crap, you're right. I'm always right. I thought we'd established this. No, you're... And I'm always left. <laughs> Two wrongs don't make a right, but three rights make a left. Left of the right, child. I got that from, uh, Fairly Odd Parents. Yes. Thanks, Edwin. Look at that. See that splooge all over the freaking wall? Mm, Where do you I knock mean, that ew. down? <laughs> Where do you... Dude, Hedwig, you're gonna get me killed here by not showing me exactly where it was. Well, it was over by the splurge. Well, let's find that splurge. Which is an incorrect term since splurge usually means to uh, shell out your money. <laughs> you know that that actually that scene from Ed and Eddie isn't actually a dirty joke. Snow job actually means like to con someone out of money. Yes, I know. I was I was going along with a joke until you got it. <laughs> Get it, snow job. It's just the way that he says it, too, is kind of suggestive. Yeah. What are we talking about? I don't know, I think... I think we peed on each other too quickly. No, just no. Hey, look, another tit. It looks more like an apple, to be honest. Like, a, like no, it looks it's like a... It's a pumpkin. A, it looks like a wumpa. Can I actually make the... I'm not even going to risk this jump, because if you fall from this height, believe it or not, it will hurt you. From this height. You remember the wumpas, right? The Wampas? Crash Bandicoot. Oh yeah, Wampus. the Wampa fruit. Wampa. Those look like they'd be really good. They look like they have the like the sturdiness of apples, yet the the flavor of peaches. That look exactly like peaches, only tastier. Hmm. How would you know if they're tastier? I have a Wampa fruit in my pants. <laughs> Giggity! <laughs> 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 Dexter was awesome. That was Mandark. I know, but the show itself, I mean, was awesome. I'm, Susan. I remember that one episode with Mandark, and he basically, everything he did when he woke up in the morning was dun da dun dun da dun da dun, 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 dun. Oh, yeah, Like when he brushed his teeth. Even like his mother, like. Dude! No! I'll have to go back. I'll be right back. We're back. We we're talking about a Hey Arnold character. I love that show. That, that was like. That was a good show, but the, like the the character design was like famously oh. bad. Oh my god. The character over the seasons, the character's hands can got considerable considerably more and more bigger. More bigger. More and more bigger. More and more. Whatever. I'm not Jeff. You don't need to quote me on my bad grammar. I'm dealing with a massive ignoramus here, folks. Hey, I'm not ignorant. All right. No, you're just an ignoramus. <laughs> anyway. Ow! Sit down. I don't feel like it. Another tit. 
Yes. You know what show had like, like, like legendary, legendarily bad character design? The Wild Thornberries. I don't remember that. No. Look up Nigel Thornberry on Google Images. <laughs> you will see what I mean. <laughs> Let's you pick up the Hogwarts I mean. of History book. If that's what we were going for? Yep. Oh, dear God. What see that? what I mean? See, isn't that kind of creepy? Yes, that is kind of creepy. I can see how that would scare a kid. I can see why if I was playing this in the dark, I kind of wouldn't want to. Hmm. And you don't have to read any of this. It just tells about the legend of the Chamber of Secrets. Huh. So you actually can read the whole thing? If you want. Well, only that. Oh. It's not a whole book. Kind of like the books in, like, like uh, Elder Scrolls. Can I actually, like, make Dude. it over here? So, can, whatever came through the door, can that actually intersect you and be a total dick? I'm gonna jump down and kill and hurt myself. Yay! Ow. Ah, his prepubescent limbs are shattered. Now I can go through this door. I think this is the right door. Or I'm just a complete retard. Nope, it's the right door. Now, we're going to get the splooge spell, as I like to call it. And we're probably going to make this a long one, because I kind of want to uh, make to the end of this so I can actually get a chance to save the game. I'm cool with that. So if this video turns out to be 25 minutes, that's probably why. <laughs> well, nothing wrong. Why nothing don't you... Wrong to... I don't feel like sitting down, that's why. All right, this guy, I have no strategy for this. You have to force him back, and he, like, sometimes he goes back, sometimes he doesn't. And he likes to laugh at you with that ho 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 Well, you know he, what he... Does he only move on this track? You know what I realize he sounds like? He sounds like those um those plants in Bubble Bloop Swamp and Banjo-Kazooie when you fall into the swamp and they laugh at you. And they go, oh. Well, no, I didn't play all that much uh, Banjo-Kazooie. Neither did I, but at least I know what that is. See so, what I mean? He doesn't go back sometimes. He's just, like, trolled. Maybe you should focus more on the projectiles, huh? From the looks of it, there's a certain timing. Those things are fucking scary, too, those ghosts, because they come at you and they go like... They look like and, like, they look kind of like the Guardians of the Silent Realm. Yeah, they do. DUDE! You know, like, floating around not having legs. Yeah. Except these things are creepier. Yeah. And they don't have swords that one hit kill you. Do they one hit kill you? No, but they're creepy as hell. They're, they're like the angry ghosts. They're poltergeists. That's what the word. You don't encounter peeves in this game, I don't think, either. Peeves? He's a poltergeist that was kind of <gasps> told about but then forgotten. All at for, Actually, what, later in the series, all the ghosts are pretty much forgotten. Hmm. Yeah, and isn't that dead ghost kind of a plot point? <sighs> See, look at how long their fucking arms are, too. That's creepy. Okay, this is kind of annoying. You have to time this out so that way you, you jump when the book goes can you, down. Can you shoot a spell while you're running? Yes. Then try that. I will, but you have to actually wait for the thing to fall down. Like, the book to fall down How all the way. Do I get out of here? Yeah, my thoughts exactly. <laughs> See? Isn't that fucking creepy? Yeah, that was kind of creepy. And I, I would imagine being there in person is a lot worse. Yeah, wait until they actually, like, come after you. I won't deny it, Harry's got balls for a little kid. <laughs> they may not have dropped, but he's got them. <laughs> wow. Yeah, and this one you actually have to time out so they're you starting can, like... to, They're starting to sound like trains. <laughs> I like trains. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Don't fall! Finger crossed. No! Yes! No! Yes! Fuck! <laughs> oh. Let's try this again here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I gotta wait for that bitch Fingers to go by. Crossed. Yes! Oh, thank god. That jump is always so hard to make. Dang it. And here is the Sploob spell. Yes, I'm gonna call it that forever. So, how many spells in this game does Harry learn by accident? Cleanliness equals wizardliness. What? What? Clears ectoplasm. You know, That's what it is, ectoplasm, wow. <laughs> yep. Nice icon. You know, I can't help but wonder, like, how awesome would it be if you could just, like, 
You get a superpower by reading a book. I'm gonna fall by down here. By not even reading a book, by looking at a book. Can I fall down here? I think I'm gonna die if I do, though. <laughs> Pretty close. That's Stay what, away from any and all. That's what the that small. That's what the less charged one looks like. This is what the big charged one looks like, and this is what it looks like when you fuck up the spell. How much do I get with you? Maybe it's on an Earth, and now you can get rid of these things somehow. Dude, more troll books. Yeah, you get hit by a single one, you're done. Well, actually. Um, I think I have a full wigging well potion. If I don't, I'm gonna shit my pants. Okay, good, I do. Thank God. You may want to take that now. Well, it, it replenishes automatically when you die. Oh. And thankfully, there's no annoying eh, eh, eh noise that makes that says, hey, you're low on health, bitch. Kingdom Hearts? Everyone. Kingdom Hearts! There's plenty of games that have that, yeah. for instance. Every Legend of Zelda game. Especially Link to the Past, because Link to the Past is like. And you usually run out of health so easily on that game, it's ridiculous. Dakota was playing Link's Awakening today. Really? Yeah. Good man. Now this is the creepy part I'm talking about, because when you get through, when you do this, you go through each room, and then a ghost pop pops out and fucking, like, bum rushes your hey, ass. Hey, think of it this way. That killed you. Because <laughs> imagine if you didn't confirm that you had, like, a Wiganweld potion. <laughs> That would have sucked. I would have got cock blocked by a ghost. Dude! I don't uh -huh. need that. I'm not even going to go in any chests because I'm pretty sure they don't have anything in them. You might as well. You never know. This game is so slow paced. Whoosh! So, is there any benefit to charging up this spell? I think one of the, some of them spell. come out of these. I'm pretty sure. I think one so of them in other words, be careful. Nope, never mind. Oh, well, still one more. That's that clown. That's that clown. Jeez, that sound is so clear, like of the tapestry falling. Oh, I know, right? You know what I always imagine? Like Super Mario Galaxy, those shiny. Like I love the shininess on like some of the metal planets. It's like if you touch them, they would feel so smooth. That's what I imagine. <laughs> Why Dude, do the, why do these ghosts want you dead? Ugh. You hear that sound? That's like me on Taco Day. <laughs> right, I'll be right back. You gonna make me something to eat? No. Bitch! <laughs> Dude, and now they're wandering around and they're gonna hit me and hurt me. Okay. Sorry, I say it's silent there. And for some reason, he's here. I don't know why. What's his name? Crab. I don't know how he got here, why he's here. He's just here. Oh, shit. How did that hit me? How in the holy mother of goodness gracious did that hit me? Splooge! I'm gonna die here. <laughs> okay. Nice. I believe you might have to fight another one at some point. Damn it, I can't teabag. There's no teabag button in this game. Shit. I wanted the teabag. So bad. Oh, more. No save point. Wah. Ladies, 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 I know everything. There is the mech and bye bye. Yes. <sighs> Giggle. Okie dokie. That's one. 
giggity giggity goo. And number two. <laughs> Boom, bitch. Get out the way, bitch. Get out the way. And now we continue on. My fine sirs. Yes, I know this is a long video. I think we're almost there. I swear to God, if I have to sneak back, that's going to be a pain in the ass. Hey, look who's back. Hey. Well, not too bad, I guess. Not too bad. Alright. <laughs> Finally, I can pretty much stop this video here. <laughs> what, what time are we at? 20 minutes and 48 seconds. Hmm. So, in the next part, we're going to give the bitch the book, and then... Smack do... her in the face? Yes. God knowledge kicking my ass once again. We'll see you guys then. Later.